I've been through some things in my lifetime that added pressure. This is, it's almost unbearable. Cheryl Couchman says she's barely had time to grieve her sister Heather, who died of cancer last May. Instead, Couchman, who is the executor of her sister's will, is preoccupied with trying to settle her estate. She can't do that until she receives Heather's official death certificate. We kept waiting, kept waiting, kept waiting, and then it got into six weeks, seven weeks, eight weeks. Now, now we're up to like three months. Roughly 60,000 Quebecers die every year. To wind up their affairs, a death certificate is a vital document for many people. Issued by the province, it's needed to access a loved one's money, pay off funeral expenses, stop bill payments, and cancel driver's licenses, car registration, and insurance. It also makes it easier to do will and life insurance searches. Across Canada, the average wait for a death certificate is 10 days plus mailing time. Alberta, Newfoundland, and British Columbia are the fastest, ranging from one to five days. In Quebec, it's supposed to be 10 days, but for the past year, it's ranged from anywhere from two to four months. Why the wait? Well, the government website says increased demand. For Couchman's family, while they wait, they're out of pocket more than $10,000. Besides funeral costs, the biggest expense, her car loan. Montreal funeral home Kane and Federley holds about 300 funerals a year. Any mail? Jane Blanchard handles death certificate requests for its clients. Hi Chantal, it's Jane from Kane and Federley. I just want to let you know that we finally, after three months, received the death certificate for your mom. She started noticing a dramatic slowdown in the government's response time last summer. We are not even um, allowed to call them to follow up until the death is two months old. Until then, there is no way of knowing if there's a problem such as missing information in the file. The government acknowledges there is a backlog. A spokesperson for the Ministry of Labour, Employment and Social Solidarity, which oversees the Civil Status Registry, said there have been several organizational upheavals in the department over the past 24 months. It's now responsible for an additional five registries, as well as the new gun registry. A shortage of workers created a backlog and led to existing staff feeling overworked. I was Preoccupied. Minister Jean Boulet said 20 extra people were hired this summer to work exclusively on death certificates. They're working overtime to get the delay back down to normal levels by the end of the year. And we have the intent to settle the situation very quickly. When I receive back from them. That's little consolation for Cheryl Couchman. The Couchman family can't pay off Heather's bills and must continue making expensive loan payments on her Hyundai if they don't want the car repossessed. Until they get the death certificate, they can't sell or transfer the car's ownership. You don't sleep at night, your, your head is just twirling, you just, you know, what's my next step, what's my next step? She just wants to move on.